Okay, I look like a mess and the lighting is awful, but, um, this- I- I literally just found out about Andy Mac, and I needed to vent, so, I guess this is it. We're not getting a season four, and like, I've known for a while that we're probably not getting a season four. And I tried to stop getting my hopes up. It, it didn't work. I still had that little hope in the back of my head that Andy Mac had better ratings than pretty much every other Disney show on right now. That of all freaking shows bunked the one nobody likes and that only had good ratings because I played it like eight times a day. Got a season four. So Andy Mac should get a season four. But then pretty much everyone in the cast started doing other projects and I'm like, that that was kind of when I was like, there's there's very little chance it's getting a season four. I still was holding out hope. I was honestly, I was waiting for Fan Fest because I thought that's when they were going to say, say that they renewed it. But, you know, obviously that didn't happen. Um, I'm sad. I'm really sad. I'm excited for June 21st because obviously I want to see the rest of season three, but come on Disney <sighs> yeah I, I'm pretty upset yeah it didn't have I mean here's the thing though if it had literally no one watching it that'd be one thing it still had like the last show that premiered Andy Mac still had even at its lowest at like 700,000 it still like what the Coop and Cami premiere had like what 500,000 so Andy Mac is still doing better than other Disney shows is the thing that baffles me. And they did that without even having to advertise much, which yeah, they should have promoted it a lot more than they did. And, you know, maybe we'd get a season four if they did, but yeah. they've I know they've gotten a little bit of bad press from this show, but they've gotten so much more good press from it. They've gotten they've gotten a lot of good press from this show. And now it's cancelled, and I'm very sad. Or no, it was the Sydney to the Max premiere that got 500,000, not Coop and Cammy. Sorry, that was, sorry, that just popped my head again. You know, um, but yeah, I'm sad, and I don't know what to do right now. We're all gonna have to stick together. Um, if you're wondering what I'm gonna do for YouTube after Andy Mac, because that's been my whole channel, I do know what I'm gonna do. Um, I, I'm not gonna be using this channel, I don't think. I might, because I've already kind of had everything set up here. I don't know. I, I don't, I don't know what I'm planning on doing. Well, I know what I'm planning on doing. I just don't know if I'm planning on using this channel or if I'm gonna start a different one to do this stuff. Basically, I'm gonna try and do booktubing because I've gotten back into reading recently and my whole goal in life is to be a writer and I've and I really 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 like booktube so that's what I'm going to be transitioning into so once Andy Mac is over once I run out of content for Andy Mac if you don't want to stick around for what I do next you can unsubscribe I understand that I, I'm at like 800 something and I'm honored and flattered that you all followed me but I know that you all followed me for Andy Mac and soon that's not really going to be an option for me anymore so that's up to you guys I would hope at least some of you stick around for that but I don't know also let me know if you want me to keep this channel or start a different one for all that stuff if I do start a different one, I'll let, I'll, I'll let you guys know, obviously, but I don't know. Um, I'm just rambling now, because I'm just really sad. I don't want Andy Mac to die yet. Like, I knew it was going to. I knew it. The longer they waited to say anything about it, the more I knew in my heart it was going to be cancelled. But come on, Disney. I'm just, I'm, it hurts. It really, really hurts. Because Andy Mac is something special. 
It really is something special. And to be honest, I don't think Disney's going to have another show like Andy Mac again. Or at least not for a long time. Bunked got a season four. And no one liked that show. Andy Mac, their most popular show with their most active fan base, didn't get a season four. It just, yeah. I would say, it's, nah, I don't know. Because you guys all understand where I'm coming from with this. Because you guys are in the same boat that I am. <sighs> Ugh, it's just frustrating and upsetting. Um, there is still some Andy Mac stuff I want to do before the show ends. I have a couple video ideas floating around in my head that I just haven't gotten around to making yet. Will I make them? I'll pr if I make them, it'll either be like within the next few days or June, probably. Because finals are coming up soon. And then I'm going to be busy for most of May, even when I go back home. So, yeah, if I'm. So, when I'm. So, like I said, do Santa Mac videos, I'll either do it very very soon or right before the show comes back and then you know once the show comes back i'll be trying to do some more regular andy mac stuff we'll see once the show ends i will be updating 35 reasons to ship tyrus with you know 35 more reasons to ship them once the whole show has aired and i can use any episode that they were in yeah, there's a couple other things i'm gonna do tyrus related most likely because that is you know that is my favorite part of the show and that's the thing about the show there's something for everybody to hook onto. for me it was definitely Tyrus for some people it was Andy and Bex and their mother-daughter relationship growing for some people it was Buffy and her storyline some people it was you know it was there was something for everybody to get hooked onto. There's something for everyone to gravitate towards. There's something to be everybody's favorite in this show. I happen to be a hopeless romantic and I love really cute love stories. And so Cyrus and TJ is naturally where my, where my heart lies. But, you know, everyone has their thing with Andy Mac. And I'm really sad that we're not going to have that after this show ends. And... For me, I know there's not going to be another show I'm going to attach to as much as I did Andy Mac. Because when it comes to shows and movies, I don't get attached very easily. The fact I got so attached to Andy Mac... This is one of the first shows I've actually gotten like into the fandom for. I just... There are some other shows I like, but this was the only one that I got really obsessed with. And so... I don't think there's going to be another one of these for a few months, at least. More likely a few years. And I doubt it'll be on Disney. What has this rant been? Has it even been a rant? This ramble? Whatever it is. I don't know. Thanks, thanks you guys for sticking with me. Today is a dark day. Be nice to yourself. Drink lots of water. And... I'll see you guys later.